there. If you want it completely round, you could stick it in styrofoam, but it's gonna lean up against them anyway, so I'm not too worried about that part. Then I'll take some brown. Knead this up, and this has a little bit of white in it, so it's a little marbleized. <clears throat> it doesn't matter, though you could have it solid or marbleized, whatever you want. And then, basically knead it up and try to just roll it into like a big ball. And then a big uh, teardrop, like that. Now they usually have like a flat side and then this part actually bends up like so. So this would go into here, and then I think we'll make this over here, the flat side. That's where it hits the ball. And then we'll draw some lines here, and we'll paint that area gold. Okay, then this, Take a little more off. It needs to go all the way down and in. Place it here. And if you twist when you go in, <clears throat> that'll help it go in. Pick it up. Decide where I want it. Okay, I'm just going to pop it here. So this is gonna need to lean right there. Get the green off my hands and then we can do the handle for the top. And then we're gonna do a little painting. We're gonna paint it silver and some gold on there. Okay, so this is gonna be the handle here. I've got some black fondant. And I will just roll this out a tad bit, cut on both sides, got an even strip here and here. And take this nice big chunky piece and this is gonna go right around the top here. And I have to, I can't really move this and show you the, but what I'm doing is I'm pushing that black up onto the top of the skewer and then I can go ahead and pop it back against him. Push this up above the skewer. Okay, and then we'll make some little lines in it for the grip. So just use this tool, go around. It's a good idea to hold on to it like this. Okay, now let me wash my hands and then we'll do the arms.